you're all doing well. Um, I thought I'd post a quick video. Um, ages ago I mentioned that I was going to talk about a couple of books I had that I thought could be interesting but kind of on the topics I talk about and things like that so um, I thought I'd just quickly show you. Um, so the first book I wanted to show you is this one. It's called Skinny Bitch and it's mainly by Rory Friedman. She's a um, there's a picture there. She's a raw foodist from New York. It's her there. Um, and basically she wrote this book, I think a bit to, to kind of shock. I mean it became, it became a bestseller and you've probably heard about it. Um, and it says in the front, a, non, a no nonsense tough love guide for savvy girls who want to stop eating crap and start looking fabulous. So. Um, it's basically very in your face, there's a lot of um, rude words in there, there's a lot of slang. Um, she basically goes through why dairy is really bad for you, why meat's crap, why diet coke's really bad, all that kind of thing. And she's kind of just like, you know, just stop complaining and get on with it and lose weight and feel fabulous. And that's her message. Um, I think some people could find it as a really good book, others could really hate it. Um, I was kind of mixed, it was alright, but it was a bit too much in your face for me but I didn't mind it's quite a good book um, another book, this book I've had for ages, it's a massive book and it's called Healing Foods and well it's called the Encyclopedia of Healing Foods and it's basically got so much interesting information I mean I'm a bit of a nerd when it comes to health and stuff I like to know like what's in foods and what it's good for and you know where you can get certain minerals and vitamins and things and so I mean, it kind of starts off telling you all about how body works and nice, <laughs> but um, it kind of then goes into every single f um, food group. Like you can look up a food, you can look up mineral, um, anything you want. Uh, and also, it can also um, you can look up illnesses, and it will tell you what foods are good for that kind of illness. So if anybody wants me to look anything up for them, I will, and I will put it into a video, um, honestly, it's great this book, I've, I've used it loads of times and it's really good. It's not only vegan by the way, it talks about all foods, but it does actually say that a vegan diet is healthier apparently, so there you go. And this last book I'm going to talk about, well, is um, my sister got me this a while back actually, I think it was for my birthday or Christmas, I can't remember, I think it's my birthday. And um, it's called The Complete Book of Raw Food. It's really fab because um, it's got over 400 recipes from the world's top raw food chefs. So it's not only one chef, what they've done is they've um, put together um, recipes from all sorts of well known people. So, like Chaz is in there, and Giuliano, and that kind of people, David Wolf. And it's just Victoria the Tenko's in there quite a lot. So it's just um, well known raw chefs have just put, there's, so there's like easy one recipes in here, there's also like gourmet ones. I've kind of tagged a load, even though I haven't made them all, I must say. <laughs> but you know, the ideas are really great. And it goes from everything from breakfast to lunch to um, dressings. Got some pictures in, I think. There's one. They always seem to be weird, the pictures. But um, these are Mexican stuffed peppers, for example. It's quite a obvious one, but then it's got things like cakes and biscuits, raw cakes, raw biscuits, things like that. I mean, a lot of it's quite good actually because each recipe tells you like what you need. So if you need like a high power blender, it will tell you which I don't have, or um, a dehydrator I don't have either. So you know which um, recipes to avoid. But it's also got ones which just use the fridge or nothing, which are really good. Look, it's even got a raw milk and cheese substitute part there. So anyway, yeah, that book. Um, Julie, uh, Julie Rodwell is the editor, but as I say, the author's mixed, um, and it's a second edition. It says revised and expanded. So yeah, that's a great book. Um, she actually also got me this book at the same time, which isn't raw, but it's vegan. She got me this one as well which is easy vegan cooking with that chocolate cake on the front. <laughs> so not exactly good as I'm on a diet at the moment, but anyway, um, it's got some, this one's got some really nice easy recipes and it's by Lee Lean Man. 
it says over 350 delicious recipes for every occasion so that's a really good one too yeah so anyway i hope those are interesting if you want me to find out where you can get them let me know but it should be enough with putting titles into google or something um and that's what i wanted to share with you anyway see you soon bye, bye.